Mark. Hello and welcome back to Dust, an Elysian tale. Now, last time we literally just started off and we still haven't quite gotten to where we want to go just yet. So, let's not dilly-dally and let's head over there and kill some more monsters or something. I think last time we went up here. No. There's already an enemy that we must face. And I've just... What to do? Well, you can't go up there, so you must go down. I do like the fact that you kind of go faster when you go down here. Hello. Where's he gone? These upgrades is mouse no at the moment is keypad is keyboard. There we go. Uh, inventory. I would like to eat. Might as well eat two of these. Next K. There we go. And let's get to the fray. Explosive 
Okay, so we need to use it. Is that a tent? Is there somebody in there? But whatever it is, it's got glowing evil eyes of evil. A merchant lies in wait. Do not let his appearance frighten you. I sense he only wishes to assist in our journey. I wasn't frightened. Just surprised at the uh, savings. Come on, let's talk to him. Okay. But yes, he does have glowing eyes. Speak to the merchant. I've been expecting you, stranger. Have you? Who are you? Merely a friend with many wares for sale. Shall we conduct business? Yes. We could buy some more of these. I've got two of them. I could buy a lo Lauter Nut. 40 health. I could also do a blue mushroom. Let's buy one of the. I think that's it. Unless. Ah, he does have a pendant. A filthy pendant. That'll be. alright. Oh, uh, yeah, warped pendant. I thought that said wrapped for some reason. Two attack and two luck. Oh. Simple pendant, which is out of my price range. Uh, obviously we don't. Eggshell, sharpening, <laughs> sharpening your blade with this works just. It's bad. Wow. Uh, sander paper. Wonder if this actually dull in your blade. Dull whetstone. Yes, that's more like it. What else do we have? We've got. We get armor made out of leaves. Or bark. Or cotton. Oops. A dull ring. Teleport stone. Oh. Yeah, that's going to be useful. Wow, that's a lot of money. And treasure keys are also a lot of money. And some items. Okay, you know what? Let's uh, buy one of these nuts. Just one. And then we're gonna buy a cotton defense fee. If you need cheek. I'm wondering if I should get the whetstone or not. What else is there? Filthy pendant. Yeah, let's get a filthy pendant. Because it's filthy. There we go, we're all done. Switch to cell mode, what can we do? Hello. I didn't know I had that. Damn. Well, um. Let's just rummage through. No, we don't want to sell them. Uh, before you leave. Might I propose an offer? Oh? That would depend on the offer. If I may be so bold, you are not prepared for the journey ahead. I, however, can offer assistance. Please, accept this blueprint as a gift. Should you find a blacksmith and the necessary materials, they may be able to craft the item for you. I can offer you materials as well, though I'm not entirely sure what materials this land deems of value. I am not from around here, as I'm sure you've guessed by now. Once you've sold me a new material type, I will be able to restock my store with it. As for your reward, I will pay you a bonus for the first new material you sell me. Ah, you'll buy them at a high price. I... well, yes. Yes, I will. Thank you. Watch your back, my friend. Ah, well, it stopped raining. This is good. We have a new quest. That uh, is not the main quest. A mysterious merchant asked you to find a load of stuff. And we need to go to the village as well. So, I'm thinking whether... How do I get to my materials? Uh, hmm. I could sell him some of this later, but where is my inventory? Are right. we gonna light chainmail? We had light. Oh no, that's blue trigger. 
Um, yeah, I'll stick this on. Let's go for that because that does three things rather than two, but uh, that gives us more stuff. We'll stick it with the filthy pendant for now. Uh, do we have any rings of power? No. Sure, no. no. Okay, we'll leave it aside then. Okay, let's uh, continue on then. Nope, there's nothing down there. What is there? Problem at all. Stand back. All right, I've got it. Wait, 
No! Oh. Having some trouble there? Yeah, I don't know. I just can't get a good enough grip. Aw, you're just trying to show off. That's sweet. Don't worry about it. I'm sure there's a way to get up there. We'll just come back later. Yep, that's a big fit, this guy. Come back later. What is that? It looks like a giant slug that Ow! Son of a bitch. Oh. Oh, what? Revival stone. I had one, apparently. Excellent. That was oddly hard. Are we nearly there? It seems like that flag is always one step away from us. Oh, yeah, apparently we are. Excellent. Looks like we're heading in the right direction. Be on your guard, Dust. I sense a powerful foe ahead of you. No. Don't worry, Dust. I'll be behind you every step of the way. Way behind. Hmm. What the hell? <laughs> it's another their persistence, I'll give them that. Much as I pity this corrupted beast, now might be a good time to demonstrate the parry technique. Oh, and now Allow it to strike. Oh, that. Hey, you dazed it! Attack and hold the button at the moment of the enemy strike, and you will parry their attack, opening them up for a counterattack. Timing is crucial. And you must be facing your opponent. Well. And as you can see, a successful parry may also daze your opponent temporarily. Now, put this beast out of its misery. Ah, oh, that was quick. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. Next time I have a slow beast, I shall parry it. I see somebody over there. Really? Ask them if they've got anything to eat. No. We're in a bit of a hurry, Fidget. Don't worry, I'll feed you later. Hey, I'm not a pet! But, uh, I would appreciate that. Thanks. Greetings, Cora. Is that your name? Wow. Oh, hello! You surprised me there. Don't get many travelers this far out of town. Sorry about that. It's nice to finally meet a friendly face. So, we're getting closer to the village then? You mean Aurora Village? Yes. It's just beyond those fields to the east. And I think you might be just in time. What do you mean? The monster attacks down there have been getting worse. Right before you showed up, I'd swear I heard somebody shouting. She's right, Dust. I can hear somebody calling for help further down the path. Let's get going. Yes. Please hurry. Be careful. Okay, old lady. That sounds surprisingly young-ish. I don't know. Let's just run. Let's just get there. Aha! Well, we're on tough, so safe monitors don't restore my health, as I found out earlier. Oh, it's probably during the cut part. Oh, it's raining, and there's an old, two old people Look! on the ground. Please, help us! Oh, she sounds old. Oh, oh hello! Uh, look at the size of that thing! Really? Don't worry, I think I can handle it. Exercise all you've learned, Dust. Send these foul creatures from this existence. Well, first of all, I'm going to use a small fry. Oh no! Oh no! 
get up. Ah. Oh. Okay, you know what? I think we're going to have to leave that there for today's episode because we failed miserably. <laughs> so, if you in oh, we enjoyed this episode of Dust and Elysian Tale, then please leave a message down below. Don't forget to like, favourite, and subscribe. I am Liberator 52nd. Until next time. Thank you.